Some members of Youngstown State's faculty have questions over the way President Jim Tressel appointed the university's interim provost. Jennifer Balagish tells us professors want a shared governance in the campus community. Why is you President Jim Tressel fielded questions for almost an hour at Wednesday's academic senate meeting at DeBartolo Hall? The educators here say they don't have a problem with Dr. Martin Abraham serving as interim provost, but they have an issue with how he was appointed. The concern has been about the procedures. Uh, when you have a search, you need to usually announce that it's been failed, announce a call for new applications. Um, and that didn't happen. So I think many faculty, including myself, are concerned about this procedure and the impact it might have on future searches here at YSU. Sixteen faculty members were part of a search committee that vetted the other provost candidates, but they never had the opportunity to do so before Dr. Abraham's appointment. They feel they should be allowed to weigh in if President Tressel decides to keep Abraham in the position permanently. We hope we get a chance to be heard on Dr. Abraham specifically, again, he may do a fine job, but we'd like to be heard. The faculty here stresses the need for a shared governance. Absolutely need to be collaborative. Still, at the end of the day, there will not be consensus when you're collaborative, so you still have to make decisions. YSU's president says he does not have a timeline on how long Dr. Abraham will serve as interim provost before he might be considered for the position permanently. Trussell is most concerned about the university moving forward. I think we have to assume that whether we call him the interim provost or the provost, that uh, he's got to help us, help us progress and help us head in the direction that I know we're capable. With more local news, I'm Jennifer Balagish.